Okay, folks, this watch is rubbish. That's six minutes 42 now, so we'll get started on our last set. And first up is this in this set is Mr. Hugh Hoffman singing White Van Man. Now, there's a well-known traditional song, The Road and the Miles to Dundee, which basically tells the story of a man and a woman who were walking to Dundee. But I thought it was time to update it to the motor age. So uh, my wife and I often go over to Dundee, A92, Dundee five miles, A92, Dundee three miles, The Road and the Miles to Dundee. So I thought uh, we'd see how that goes in the modern age. I am a white van man delivering parcels from four four to five, from logs to lochy. My deadlines are tight, so I drive like the clappers. Traffic lights and speed limits mean little to me as we travel the road and the miles to Dundee. When I need a break, I stop at a cafe for a big plate of chips and a mug of strong tea. I know all the back roads, the shortcuts, the rat runs. We make a fine team, my sat nav and me, as we travel the road and the miles to Dundee. Now one winter's evening, my last parcel delivered. Radio blaring, I drove home for my tea. I had to slow down through the cones in the roadworks when a lonely hitchhiker I happened to see. As we travel the road and the miles to Dundee. Now I do not usually pick up hitchhikers, but something about him attracted my e. The traffic had stopped, so I beckoned to him. It was then that I noticed that he was a she. As we travel the road and the miles to Dundee. She thanked me for stopping. She said she was going to visit her family back home in Dundee. I told her that Dundee was where I was heading. And so we drove on for a mile or three as we traveled the road and the miles to Dundee. Now she was a looker and she was a talker. We soon hit it off, she was good company. She smiled, flashed her eyes. It was clear she was flirting. I started to wonder <laughs> what my chances might be as we travelled the road and the miles to Dundee. But the wind it was rising, the snow started falling, the white stuff lay thick in my headlights' bright beam. My van hit a drift, the wheels lost their grip. We slid off the road, nearly hit a big tree as we travelled the road and the miles to Dundee. I said I'd try pushing if she'd do the steering. I wrapped my coat round me, she sat at the wheel. Two other lads came to offer assistance, and together we managed to push the van free as we travelled the road and the miles to Dundee. The two lads and I, we stopped for a breather. We could scarcely believe what next we did see. The van drove away, as we stood there shouting, she'd left us all stranded beneath the big tree as we travelled the road and the miles to Dundee. I walked to the town, to the nearest police station. They checked their computer, made some phone calls for me. The van had been found, but not the hitchhiker who took me for a ride on the road to Dundee. She took me for a ride on the road to Dundee. Thank you. 